Lack of patience often leads to poor driver behavior. I got a handful of emails from viewers like David writing if the city's traffic engineers really wanted to help with improving traffic flow, they could time signals on every street to keep drivers from hitting the brakes at every intersection. Yes, it's annoying. You hit every red light. Drivers like Elliot Frywright reaching out to Operation Safe Roads. You drive the speed limit uh, in time to hit each red light from Indian School down to the freeway. Concerned with how that frustration could fuel drivers to accelerate through a light when they shouldn't. And Elliot is honest enough to admit he's one of them. If I miss six lights and the seventh one turns yellow, I'm not stopping. So I reached out to Goodyear and they tell me after talking to Elliot, they have traffic engineers manually resetting the timer at a problem intersection twice a week to ensure consistency and new technology will be added the first part of next year. And so on, that's where we can kind of predict how traffic flow, traffic flow is going to operate. In Phoenix City, traffic engineers say they monitor a variety of factors, including the speed limit, not the speed cars are actually traveling, and traffic volumes. Now we take the software and optimize the bandwidths for, to favor both directions. The data collection and investigation on each intersection and optimizing 10 to 15 intersections together takes about three to five months. But Simon Ramos tells me they will look into intersections as soon as they get a complaint from a commuter. And Elliot doesn't mind letting the city know if it means drivers like himself would be more inclined to make safer decisions. Saving one life is, is it's not that important unless it's mine or my kids or, you know, my wife's. So yeah, it's important that we need to stop that. And some of it, a little bit of it will be stopped if we get more lights time. Every person matters as it could be someone you know and love. Traffic engineers stress going the speed limit is the best way to hit that so-called green wave. Tonight, ABC 15 investigator Melissa Blasius looks at technology being tested in one valley city that will hold the green light for you so you don't have to slam on the brakes or gun the engine to beat the red. That's tonight at 10 p.m.